Okay, we're here live with Mikey, Puerto Rican Mike and Jesse on the way back to Cerro Gordo. We just did a nice shopping. And Mr. Marone is uh, supplying up the house for the big hurricane coming next uh, couple of days. Uh, we have enough food and water. Actually, we need to get some water. We're going to get a supply of water soon. Tomorrow, the next day, we're going to supply of water. Uh, what do you think, Dad? Uh, are we going to be tied down and everything should be good for this hurricane? Dad? What do you think? Well, we'll be able to... Uh, do you have enough uh, electricity? Uh, what do we have in the house to keep us going for the next three or four weeks? If I got one bottle of water and one bottle of scotch. Okay, no, we need some more, like at least seven bottles of water. And around how many gallons of diesel fuel do we need, Dad? Uh? How many would you need? 10, 10, 10 uh, gallons, uh, 100 gallons of diesel fuel? Dad? Oh, this is the... Yeah, so what's going on? How come Jan hasn't called you today? Dad? Like we haven't got, how come you haven't gotten a call from Jan today? Dad? I got one like her. Well, who's this now on the phone? Texas. Nope, the delete and not answer. Hey, hit the red button, that deletes them. The red button hangs up on them. There you go, that's green, Dad. I can't fucking eat it. I, I, tried to, I tried to answer, I couldn't answer, I was gonna answer it. No, you don't, up. you don't need to answer those guys. You're not, uh, not available for those guys. But my father gets these phone calls from these telemarketers all the time. It's like, you know, he goes, oh, here's another phone call. I'm that popular. He reminds me of Rain Man. He's a very good driver. But what they do with these telemarketers is they... Like, they who the fuck cares? They constantly and call. And don't you dare put me on They con They con call constantly, and they, um, they, they try to take advantage of people. He's telling, they call me all the time, the telemarketers. Yeah, but you got to call more than No. So these that's telemarketers, yeah, they, 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 they come after the, the senior citizens because they, they're so nice. The senior citizens lose the eye of the tiger and they, they, just, they talk and then they go, oh, uh, you know, you need to breathe. And my father, oh, yes, I need to breathe. And then they got you. So they have these, these like, uh, these scenarios, these how to get someone to answer the phone call or answer your question without hanging up. It's like, do you use oxygen? Like I donate $50 every time they call me. Yeah, that's the, why they call do me. you use oxygen? $50 so, every time they call That's right. When they say, yeah. do, do, you, do you use oxygen? And he goes, oh, yes, I use oxygen. I'm a very good driver. So they got you. So that's what they do. They call up and they go, hello, sir. I am from the telemarketing. No, I don't want to hear you. No, do you need oxygen? Oh, yes, I need oxygen. Yes, oxygen is very good for me. So we have the uh, unknown comic, and then we have the unknown comedian, and then we have the unknown Jesse with the uh, the piece of paper in front of his face because he's uh, he's hiding his uh, appearance. But we don't know who he is, do we? I don't think we know who he is. Anyway, back to what I was saying. These telemarketers, as soon as you get a new phone, they call you up on the phone and they go, "Hello, how are you? This is the telemarketing. Uh, do you breathe?" Oh, yes, I breathe. Oh, and then they got you. Or they, like, say, hey, do you go to the bathroom? Yeah, I go to the bathroom. Or they say, um, you know, uh, did you brush no, your teeth I today? No, I shit my pants. I don't want to pants. <laughs> yeah, I got, I got He's back, Mr. Marone. You're back. How is it? No, I'm, I'm not back. You're back from Get me off that fucking thing. I don't want to be on that. You're not on anything. Right? I don't want to be on that thing. You're not on anything right now. I don't right want now. to be on that thing. This is not even recording. you understand? It's not recording at all right now. I'm just holding the camera up to get a reaction from you. That's all. So uh, so when did Jan call? Jan called this morning, Dad? Anyway, all right, so back to uh, Puerto Rico, Mike and Jesse. Right now we're driving in Puerto Rico on the way back from Walmart. We've supplied the house with uh, enough food for the next two weeks. Uh, my father's leaving in a week, but he, you know this way I have food and I can eat while he's gone. Uh, he's been very, he's a very generous man, he, he takes care of me, I love him very much. He, he leaves me a, a little money on the side just in case I need it. 
And if it wasn't for my dad, I'd probably be on the street and a bum and uh, begging. And my dad helps me with my disease and it keeps me happy and, and it keeps me uh, feeling good. He's a great guy, my dad. And uh, would you concur to that, Dad? You're a great guy? No. And how are you feeling today? How are you feeling? With your, with your hands. All right, Puerto Rican Mike, we're signing off. I will talk to you later. Take it easy. Out and we'll go. Take a look at the, rock, the weather here.